all but maybe three halves of the season, we've pretty, been pretty dominant on the ball and, and carried the game to the team. One of the challenges when you have, you know, six, seven, eight hundred passes is feeling the, the fear and the danger that, you know, the game's not over. You know, it's not done until it's done. A-10 play started, so we wanted to come out with some intensity, and, you know, we felt like, you know, this was the game to make a change and make the difference and start the season up, get some wins behind us. Good speed, continuing to go. Makes the bump, stays still, still going. Here's Eli Lockerbie off to Horan's. He scores! Jorge Horan's on a great run from Eli Lockerbie. Hey, we all know how, how fast it is Eli and how good he is with his, with his dribbling. He just uh, take the ball from the back, he dribbled like four or five guys. He made me the pass, I, I took a touch and I just finished today. Honestly, after I beat the first guy, I just wanted to see if something opened up for me and it ended up and found Jorge on the left and he, it was a great finish. So, all the credit to Jorge, he's the one who put it in the back of the net. Working towards the box, and the cross, turning and shooting, and scoring! Beautiful goal from VCU as they go up 2 to nothing. We've been pretty dominant in the league in terms of records. We've not lost much. I think we've lost, you know, maybe five games in, in four years. I mean, we've never finished above third. You know, we know how important points can be in the A-10. It's going to be very, very tight throughout the season. Any win is good, but in the A-10, you know, it really means something. You know, it puts us in good position for the tournament. And, you know, we just wanted to really start off strong, you know, 1-0 in the A-10.